Good morning, I'm Valley Anderson. Today is Monday, June 29th. Welcome to Sunrise with Dr. Serge Akana. Dr. Akana is a servant of the underserved and an advocate of his most recently launched Post-Incarceration Juvenile Justice Reformation Act, which is also known as Returning Youth Initiative. This initiative assures youth that a release from incarceration have the ability to create a self-sustaining productive life for themselves. How are you doing today this morning? Good morning, Valley, uh, for having me on this Monday, wonderful sunny day in East Coast. And good morning, audience, those who are listening to me and will be listening. I'm really excited uh, that today I would like to concentrate a little bit about what happened in Montana over the weekend with the Returning Youth Initiative. So Valley, why don't you tell us a little bit how your board of directors and the volunteers of the Safe Haven started some community activities and how everybody were receptive about this initiative? Yeah, so every year our uh, county has a 50 mile yard sale. So there's yard sales going up down the highway just this one weekend out of every year. And each year, our county manager, Carrie Anderson participates. So instead of going to the farmer's market to set up a booth this time, we chose to do it at her yard sale because she has a lot of foot traffic in. So with that, we, um, we talked to a lot of great people. Um, we again, passed out so many applications and flyers. Um, we were selling hot dogs, chips, cotton candy and water. So that was all good, but it was it was really nice to see like the feedback and I don't know, people I feel like at the farmer's market aren't as receptive I saw compared to the yard sale, which is a little different, but um, they, they all seem really excited to, to participate and start helping us volunteer more. And we're ready. We actually are placed to volunteer for a different organization already at the middle of August. So. We're looking forward to it. Wow, this is very exciting. I think this should inspire the young adults, those who are coming out of jail, that there is a hope. And also what we are trying to do is educate the society so that they can accept this type of individuals in the society back. Because all these individuals do have a lot of talents. And let me tell you, Valley, and I'm sure you know this, that our initiative very soon will be launching Returning Youth Talent Show. So we are going to all, this, all the six regions. We have divided the, um, uh, divided the uh, United States into six region. And from the six, we'll be going out for every region, we'll be collecting applications online, of course, and the whole team is getting ready. We'll, we have a production company, we have a sponsorship, all these things are building place. This is how we can get these young adults, those are coming out of jail, to exhibit their talents because we want the society to accept them. So you feel that based on your experience last Saturday, you feel that the society also wants to help, right? For sure. And I think also like the, um, find, like uh, advocating for their own talents would help them mentally as well, not just the society's view. It will help bring them up and feel more confident in their own skin. And I think it could be a really good thing to, to see and watch play out. Absolutely. Well, this is what we wanted to highlight today in this Monday morning that my dear young adults, those are coming out of jail, do not give up the hope. We are here, especially those who are listening from Montana State. Please reach out to our county manager, Carrie Anderson. You can also reach out to the host of this Sunrise Valley who, who can be reached out. Anybody wants to reach out, please go to our web, website. Please go to our uh, uh, different social media we are there to help you to take to the next level. Our, 
our, our safe haven in Hamilton is doing great and we want more and more involvement of the community. So again, thank you very much, Valley. Yes, thank you, Dr. Connor, for joining today. If you wish to know more about this initiative, please visit our website, returningyouth.com. As you all know, we bring Sunrise to you every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, shortly after 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. You can watch us on Facebook, Instagram, or YouTube at Returning Youth or Connor for Youth. Thank you for tuning in. We will see you again on Wednesday. God bless.